So the case-based method is a real-world approach to learning that allows students to put themselves in the position of a decision maker or a group of decision makers to grapple with some of the real-world challenges that they may face in their career. A leading mind type thinker there. In right? a case-based class, yeah. students will come to class having read some problem that has been described. Students are asked to not only think about the facts, but also think about some of the external factors that maybe aren't listed in the case. So just because Ideally, we want to teach our students to be critical thinkers and active listeners. We build on the foundations that they will pick up in textbooks and articles, and we take their thinking to the next level by getting them to analyze, synthesize, aggregate, and at the end of the day, ultimately make decisions that will shape a problem or the solution to that problem. It's an interdisciplinary approach that we take in learning material. So it's a lot different than the didactic professor standing up in front of a classroom teaching students. It allows us to get a whole world view on public health problems, and it creates a really dynamic class environment. Because of the, the diversity in our classroom and how dynamic our conversations are, we're able to implement flexible thinking we're able to learn lifelong learning models. So as important as the material is, the thinking process that goes behind it is really crucial. Public health is such a complex field at the intersection of so many disciplines and so many sectors. The case-based method allows students to experience what public health is like by bringing in those multiple perspectives. Our classroom is a rich environment full of different academic, practical, professional backgrounds, and we try to really bring that to life in helping our students figure out the best way to solve problems.